it is, guys. Today I went to the dollar store, bought myself some non fried noodles. It says boiling water, blah, 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 blah. Wait three minutes. It says that the heat transfers through the cup, which it does, it's really freaking hot. Nutritional facts, as you can read them here. Then it tells you no MSG, two for a dollar twenty-five, which is actually a dollar forty with tax. This is what she looks like in the picture. Now I've let it sit ooh long enough. Ooh, it's hot. Ooh, look at this. Oh man, look at that. Beautiful. Okay. So now digging out of the noodles are you can see I don't know if you guys can see the steam but she is piping okay, let's see if I can hold on guys mm. okay. you may see the, the broth gotta be careful hold on Watery is okay. All right, so what can you expect for a dollar forty? Well, I wouldn't really recommend getting these uh, noodles, even though this is beef flavor. Looks like beef, right? I wouldn't really recommend them. Uh, I thought they'd be better than this, especially considering they're more expensive than Mr. Noodle. And Mr. Noodle here is like 50 cents a pack or something like that. And Mr. Noodle's way better. The noodles do not... If uh, you, you could probably leave it for 5 to 10 minutes and it would still be the same. The noodles, after about 3 minutes... I don't know if it tells me on the lid. Yeah, it tells you 3 minutes of leaving the lid on, let it stand, blah, blah. And I stir well before whatever, as you can tell. Now, this would be good for somebody who likes cups of soup. And sometimes cups of soup can get expensive. I mean, if you don't mind dollar store food, I don't think it'd be a big deal. For me, I, I bought, I got well, obviously two for a dollar forty, so can't really complain much. Um, you get what you pay for, but this kind of not really. Um, I thought it'd be better, but again. If you're in the poorhouse and you want noodles and you want a cup of noodles and you don't feel like spending too much, I would recommend grabbing them if you don't mind how things taste, if they're bland or sort of kind of okay. But if you're in that high-end um, palate area where you like really good food, then I would recommend you not to get this. So it's based on you. Me, I will not be getting them again. I give them a... <laughs> A 4 out of 10 due to the fact that I waited like 5 minutes for the water to boil. Or not boil, but to, to sit in here. And it's still the same. I mean, if you want to... I don't know. It's just... It's not very good. Alright, guys. So... I don't know. If you're into it, get it. If not, then I would avoid it. Um, that's up to you. Me, I'll avoid it, like I said, and yeah, I hope you guys like the video, comment, like, and or subscribe. Having issues getting my content out there, so can you please share my content, and that would be, I would be ever so grateful. Um, I plan to do more of these food reviews from the dollar store soon. I had Viva Puffs earlier, but you guys already know those taste amazing, no matter where you get them. Uh-oh, I think I covered the microphone. Hopefully it uh, picks up. Anyway, guys, I'm going to get out of here, I'm going to go play some games, and surf some youtube and get on out of here so yeah I'm, i think i'll just finish it i'm not gonna waste my money <laughs> down the drain or nothing you know so anyway guys peace